5 amino 1 MQ. You may or may not have heard of this compound, and I haven't heard of it until about two years ago in 2022. So 5 amino 1 MQ is super interesting because, because of its potential to deal with um, especially age related obesity and metabolic issues. So, the way that it works is that it blocks the enzyme NNMT. Uh, NNMT, more than you need to know, is a nicotinamide N methyltransferase. By inhibiting this enzyme, it actually inhibits um, like, like lipogenesis, a creation of new fat, uh, inflammation, uh, lipid profiles, and things like that. So let me explain a little bit more. But it's it's based on the in, uh, inhibiting NNMT. Now, the thing about NNMT, which is an enzyme, enzymes just make other things happen, is this is an enzyme that gets more active with age. And that's what really got me curious, because when I, you know, I do a bunch of reading, I was reading about this thing, and, and when you read the potential benefits, it's just kind of too good to be true. It's like, this is, this is crazy. Um, so let me read it through, through a few of the, you know, potential benefits. Now, the big one, if you look up 5-amino on MQ, the first one it's going to say is, oh, weight loss. And that's great because that's what a lot of people are looking for. Um, but it goes so far beyond that. So but let's let's first address weight loss. So by inhibiting NNMT, it can actually reduce the size of the fat cell and it can inhibit the body's um, need to store fat, um, the creation of new fat, um, even if you're in an energy surplus. So that was kind of interesting. Like, well, you're not going to gain weight. So that kind of was interesting in reducing the, the fat cell, also increasing, increasing your metabolism, expenditure, uh, all sounds really great. But then when you look a little bit different, um, helps to lower appetite. Now, I'm going to explain to you, or sorry, I'm just looking at my notes. I'm going to go through my actual experience with it. And lowering appetite, this isn't like some Ozempic effect. This isn't like, oh my gosh, you can't eat at all. But for me, it was a very subtle um, very subtle change. Um, but anyway, I'll get on to that. But yes, it uh, suppresses so a reduction in appetite. So not a loss of appetite, but a reduction of appetite. It influ influences metabolic pathways that are possibly affecting um, the appetite regulation ho uh, hormones. Lowering cl uh, cholesterol. So this is where I got really interested with regards to my husband. So it is the potential benefit of lowering total cholesterol, lowering LDL, lowering triglycerides, which really got me interested, lower, uh, re reducing inflammation, um, increasing the good cholesterol, HDL, uh, reducing the risk of certain cancers. And um, the big one for me was preserving muscle mass. So preserving muscle mass during weight loss is really crucial for overall strength and metabolism. And 5-amino-1-MQ can help balance muscle and fat metabolism, ensuring that muscle mass is uh, actually maintained even if you are losing fat. Now, when I read that, I'm like, okay, I'm 57 and I, I train really hard and I train really heavy. I have done my entire life and I'm uh, I've got a huge bias for protein. And I still have noticed a dramatic loss of muscle in, in my 50s. So that really got me interested. So what I did, so um, I had some, I had some travel coming up. I'll try and keep this short, but um, I had some travel coming up. So I'm going back to uh, 2022, I think it was. I was reading about this, super fascinated in this. Uh, found the product on um, Peptide Science and uh, a very, very reputable uh, website if you'd rather go there no no dog in that fight great website and um i bought a three month supply so it's, it was 250 dollars for one month supply and i used it for three months but it was a perfect time for me to test this product because i was going to england several times um and then in england you know my training gets a little bit off i'm eating out an awful lot i'm not in my own kitchen travel jet lag all that good stuff and uh, then I was going to come back and go immediately to a 10 day vacation in California for my husband's birthday. And that was going to be uh, that was Vegas, Laguna Beach, back through L.A., back through Palm Springs. It was I mean, I think he had six birthdays eating out 
least once or twice a week. Traveling, did it all in the car, so um, the training was completely off. So perfect opportunity for me to test this product, right? So I started taking this uh, product uh, be before these trips. Um, so it was the end end of 2022, beginning of 2023, that's what it was. And at the end of it, I got on the scale and I'd lost a pound. And I was like, okay, I'm onto something here because I should have gained legit four or five pounds. Honestly, I really should. And I'd lost a pound. So I'm like, hmm. Anyway, that was, you know, I'd, I'd spent a, a $750 on that. And I was like, okay, I really want to um, keep using this product and I actually want to use it for Kevin because Kevin's blood work hasn't been the best and he's been told for years that it's genetic because his dad's had five heart attacks he had his first heart attack at 50 and it's still his blood work always worried me and because of the the potential benefits of five amino one mq on blood work I really wanted Kevin to take it so but then I'm like well if we're both going to take it I mean it gets up there so I decided I'm going to source it myself so I spent the next probably what was six or eight months, probably so, probably that was next month, six months researching and sorting it myself. And I had the company send me a batch of capsules. And I was just like, okay, me and Kevin are going to take this for, you know, two or three months. And I'm just going to really assess what happened. Well, what happened was uh, I ended up going back to England. Um, my mom was dying. I knew that. And then she passed. So I went back to England another five times and uh, back to back. So my schedule was way off, eating out all the time, just, just um, chaotic. Um, there was also uh, another trip to, to California thrown in there. And um, what happened was I got back from, so we started taking it, the our own product, the first week of June. And I remember that because I left on the second week of June to go to England for my dad's 90th birthday. And um, so I came back from that trip and I got on the scale the next day. So I would never do that. I just got off a plane from Europe. I would never get on the scale the day after just because, you know, you, the transport, the, the airplane, the flight, you, you never, you're never going to be your best. But I did. I got on the scale uh, immediately afterwards. The day after uh, I landed and I was the same weight. <laughs> Like, this is crazy, okay? So we keep taking it, and then um, it was the end of July, so we've probably been taking about eight, eight weeks, something like that, and uh, Kevin did his blood work. Now, the if you're watching this on my website, the image will be in there. But so he did his blood work. So he did it. He'd done his blood work in February, and he did it again in um, July specifically for this. And his total cholesterol went down by, I think it's 35 points. His, his triglycerides went down from 175 to 150. Now, that to me is a game changer. And his LDL went down, I think, 35 points. And his HDL went up uh, 20 points. Kevin's HDL, good cholesterol, if you, you don't know, has never been higher than 40. And it was, I think, it's 57. Uh, coupled with the fact that Kevin lost 12 pounds and feels stronger than ever. And I, I'll talk about my experience in a second, but he, he says he he's re really feels very strong in the gym. So these are just our ex experiences. I'm not making any claims. Maybe it's the placebo effect. I don't know, but I'm not making any claims at all. But for us, everything that it was listing as a potential benefit was work was happening now what was interesting is i had read somewhere that like oh it can take six weeks to get going and it, what, it, it didn't do that um especially with the not gaining weight thing that was kind of immediate anyway we've just come back from california we were just there uh, to, for the last uh, nine days we literally just got back this week and yet again we were heating out uh twice a day uh, i think we've gone for nine days i trained four uh, we had a massive party in California, uh, eating the whole time, and I got on the scale, and I the same, I li literally the same weight. I literally left the scale set at the weight I was on because I got one of those old fashioned calibrator scales, and I just got back on it again. I was exactly the same. Um, Kevin, uh, <laughs> Kevin's funny. He came back nine pounds heavier, and then two days later he's back down to the weight. He was just he was just bloated and and 
full of food. Uh, so anyway, he has, uh, he's down to the weight that he left. So this has been a really fascinating um, experience for us. Now, with regards to the muscle, which was my initial reason for getting into this, was I'm definitely stronger. Um, in my movement patterns, in my squats, in my deadlift, in my lunge, I'm definitely stronger. I feel strong. And what's interesting, and I don't know if this has got anything to do with 5 amino one mq but maybe because of the inflammation um, and potential benefits, is I I'm pain-free. So usually I've got something going on in my body that's niggling me. It's like my shoulder's niggling me. I'll go to lunge and it'll take a set or two to get into it or squat my back sit on my head. There's always something, you know, going on. There's nothing. Um, I'm strong. My body feels good. Uh, I, I, and um, I, I really feel like I'm holding on to my muscle now. My muscle feels fuller. Um, so this is a supplement that... Uh, so then I got the company to bottle it, label it, and all that good stuff. But honestly, uh, hand on heart, my only intention of, of making this product was just so me and Ke Kevin will always have um, a cost-effective way of continuing to take this product forever. Uh, I am just sharing this information because this is our experience. And th there's just some great, you know, the, the, there's just so many. I mean, we know how wonderful supplements can can work. You know, you take a, a a fish oil, and we know it brings down inflammation and all the benefits that go with that. And we're just on the precipice of just some really amazing stuff. So the other reason I, I was looking into this product. So after the the first time when I'd used the three months from Peptide Science, so it was right about then, like 2023 when a lot of my coaching clients started taking Ozempic and Monjaro and all that. And I'm, I've no, I've, I've no dog in that fight. I, I think the only thing lacking there is the lack of coaching to help people with that. Um, so I was really researching those peptides. So I would be able to coach my clients very uh, effectively um, with those, with those products. And then I started looking at five amino one MQ and I'm like, for one, it's stable enough to be taken orally, so there's no injection. Um, and two, I'm thinking, gosh, could this be an alternative to, you know, these more aggressive peptides? Uh, and or could this be something that my clients can switch over onto at some point? Because, you know, then maybe they get to the weight that they want to be and, and this will, you know, um, inhibit weight gain. So the potential was just, I, I, I saw it with my clients, I saw it with me. I really saw it with Kevin's blood work and it's kind of in our experience it has checked all the boxes. But again, I am not making any claims um, with this. This is a product that I have, I have sourced myself. I've uh, used, used our, me and Kevin have been our own guinea pigs and really evaluated and really tracked how things changed for us over three months of taking our own, own product. Um, and again, nothing changed. So our nutrition is the same. Our, our training is the same. We deliberately didn't change anything at all. That is the only thing different. So that's 5-amino-1-MQ. Uh, I hope this is interesting. And um, just, we're, we're in really exciting times. Now, I, I will say that with regards to all the great things that are happening in the weight loss and um, you know metabolic health field, uh, the, the coaching is the same. And ultimately, that's where I am. You know, I'm a body composition coach and the coaching is the same. So whether you, you take in a peptide or taking five amino one and Q, you know, creating optimal health through nutritional lifestyle and exercise is still very, very important. And these are just adjuncts which are just fascinating.